a long-awaited beer review before it's too late and before I head back into the city where it's kind of illegal to be drinking in public I thought I'd review this now amber I recall drinking this on draft on tap de grifo in the UK and it being a pretty substandard beer in comparison to how incredibly high the standard is for ales and bitter ales in the UK so I wasn't too sure about this and it is fantastic I have to say it's the amber IPA so India pale ale and it's the doble so it's the double hop double what's the word double hopped I think you, you call it it's heavy it's strong it's 7.6 percent so it's not one to mess around with um, it's the can is 44 centiliters which is nice it's 440 mil as opposed to the standard Spanish cans which are 330 like a standard can of coke it's, it's closer to a half uh, to a full pint obviously not quite 568 unfortunately but it's really fantastic the flavor is out of this world it's the best IPA that I've been able to find here it costs around 1 euro 45 for a can which is quite expensive here but it is that much bigger and it's that much stronger so I think it's more than reasonable there's a standard single hop version which is okay and I think that's what I had in the UK previously and it's really nothing special it's one to avoid for 10 cents more this is significantly better it's, it's really quite an excellent beer if you have three or four of them you feel a little bit groggy um, it does uh, it plays games with your stomach as well but just if you just have one or two it's really super aromatic it's intense it's really highly highly recommended there are a number of the big breweries here in Spain that try to do an IPA and most of them are pretty bad I have to say um, including Mao which I'll I'll review on another day I had that last night and there's just it's like night and day the difference is, is so extreme so amber ale IPA double hopped highly recommended if you can find it